Hello, my name is Darius Gilmer with Junks Controls. I'm a systems engineer level two, and I am responsible for all of your programming and your engineering needs here at CDC. Uh, today we're here to talk about uh, the new system, the battery room upgrade for building 23. Okay, you have a couple of components. One, you have uh, your exhaust fan here, which is FAB004. Uh, four. And this exhaust fan uh, is responsible for exhausting air out of this battery room. All right, this fan runs at a, a constant speed. It runs all the times and you can uh, turn it on and off from your front end workstation. Um, we also have, just to go over a couple of components of the exhaust fan, this exhaust fan has a couple of components and one of them is your rear relay up here mounted on the wall across from the exhaust fan and it also contains a CT that is in your control box you will see that is a Johnson Control CT and it will be colored blue. Uh, along with your fan system that we have here, you have two hydrogen uh, sensors to hydrogen monitors here mounted outside of your door. These are just the LED uh, LCD readings for you so that you'll know the hydrogen level before you walk in the room. Right now currently you have zero which is typically what you would want to see uh, in a normal situation. We have two sensors in this room that also detects the hydrogen that reports back to these monitors. And this along with your exhaust fan go back to uh, Junts Control's controller and FEC controller that is mounted inside your mechanical room which we'll be visiting here shortly. All right, so we're now inside of your switch gear room. Your switch gear room is where your batteries are located and also where your two hydrogen sensors are. They're about 25 feet up in the air on the ceiling. You have one here that is directly up over the batteries and then you have one there which is adjacent to that one. Okay, now all, once again, those report back to your hydrogen displays that are on the outside of the door. So you already know what the reading is before you come in the room. If you ever have an alarm out there, it will start beeping and all you do is hit the reset button on the side of it. And then you can decide if it's safe to come in or not. Okay, now we're going to go visit where your actual controller is that all this is tied to. So now we're in your mechanical room that's around the corner from your switch gear room. I just wanted to show you guys where your controller is. Here's your controller. It's right next to the existing controller that you already have. You have an FEC and an IOM in here. The IOM currently right now is just spare. You got a few extra inputs and outputs on the FEC. This FEC is where everything ties back into your exhaust fan and all your hydrogen uh, control panels tie back into here which then goes and it ties back into your NAE for this building and that ties into your front end where you can see and control and monitor any of the points that you would need to run this system. 